let's practice connecting Premiere Pro and After Effects together. So here we have a Premiere Pro CS6 project and the idea is that we actually imported an After Effects project. So what we do here is you go to File, Import, and then you just browse for your actual After Effects project. And there it is, the After Effects project called AAA. And once you do so, it just asks you, do you want to choose which composition? We chose composition one, and here it is, and you just drag drag this into the timeline. Now what's interesting here is that it's actually uh, does automatically update as you make changes in After Effects. So let's uh, <clears throat> go back to After Effects. You can see that this project here plays uh, the letter BBB for about uh, five seconds. Let's go to After Effects and uh, what I'm going to do here in After Effects is I'm going to change the letters to CCC and within After Effects notice how you can actually go to the uh, composition composition settings and you can uh, change how long you want the duration to be so for example if you want the duration to be uh, let's say just three seconds long that's three seconds click on OK and what we have is we have a three second uh, video clip and I also change the letters B's to C's so let's go file save so you saved it now let's uh, tap into the Premiere Pro notice how you see that uh, these little diagonal lines means that the video no longer exists here and that makes sense because we automatically updated our composition which is linked to our After Effects project called AAA.AEP After Effects project and so all we need to do is <clears throat> drag the right hand uh, slidey bar to where it does exist so in this case it's really short and just have to uh, slide it out and that's the maximum length of it now and notice how the letters B change to the letter C's alright so this opens up a lot of possibilities you have multiple different After Effects projects you can all link it back into Premiere Pro and you can uh, have everything update automatically so Premiere Pro is <coughs> uh, really geared towards putting everything together whereas After Effects can take care of some short special effects and, uh, and this all works very well